What up, y'all? Delvon Lamar of the Delvon Lamar Organ Trio here with Amy Novo, aka Shortcake. The brains of the operation is finally here behind camera. But you don't like being in front of the camera, she so it's a little awkward. Hates it, and I love it because so you can make just fun of me. Watch her squirm. Yeah, I don't want to be here. Anyway, I do want to do that. Okay. So, I'm going to go ahead and start. Um, I've been MIA for a little while. I've had to take care of my health. A lot of people have known for a while, um, for almost going on three years. Um, I don't like talking about my health. I think it became a little too consumed. I do want to let everybody know that I worked really hard, and I am back. i still been working behind the scenes, but I'm doing better now, and I can, I'm working to continue to be as healthy as possible so I can continue doing what I'm doing for all of you. All of you guys. I love you. Because oh. without you, we can't oh. do what we do. You love another people behind my back. No, I'm just kidding. A lot of people. <laughs> <laughs> what is that mean? But, uh, yeah, so I want to take the time to welcome, to say welcome to all our fans and all our new fans. We've met, uh, so many people over the years like being on the road and just over social media so we don't ever get a chance to say what's up to everybody so what's up everybody what's up? but we've been asked um there's a lot of people that don't know our story and i don't like talking about how we met oh i do but he does oh, so i'll yeah. let him tell you all right I, I might be smacking him a little bit behind the scenes though so all right Really? So, mm -hmm. I met this crazy lady of mine. Uh, it was one of the very few successful internet dates out there. Yeah. We met what on, year? oh, 2006. Girl mm -hmm. I know, July 5th, to be exact. Well, that's when we met in person. Whatever. That's when we started dating. The wires were before that. Whatever. So internet the wires. internet correspondence mm -hmm. were before that, but yeah, I met her on Plenty of Fish. Oh, no, you're not. Oh say yeah, that. No. I don't go on Plenty of Fish. I was convinced by my little brother mm -hmm. to go on to Plenty of Fish because I lived in Spokane, Washington, mm -hmm. and my family wanted me to stay there because they know that I don't want to live there. Mm -hmm. So they were trying to convince me to meet people locally. Well, so he helped me set up a Plenty of Fish mm -hmm. account. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, this is not me. I'm not looking for a hookup. Obviously, somebody was. Um, but I went to the library, went on my account. Wasn't and me. there was uh, Del Vaughn hitting me up. I'm like, I don't go on here. But you can go meet me on MySpace. I don't know if that's any better. Yeah. That might be the same thing. Does that still exist? I don't know. I don't know. I haven't seen a MySpace in like a really long time. Yeah. Anyway, so yeah, I hit her up. On I'm MySpace. A, I'm I a, wouldn't talk to him on Plenty of Fish. She still gives me a lot of, um, yap, I can say, can I cuss? She gives me a lot of shit about, uh, my, uh, copy and paste skills. I had no idea. He copy and pasted everything he said to me from some other man that was sending stuff that he said, you know what? I like what he's saying. So I'm going to send it to her. Hey, it's the way I felt. I just didn't have to type it. Somebody already back. did it. So therefore... I'm a genius, yeah. and she, obviously she I'm liked a fool. it. Sixteen later, sixteen years 16 later, later, she's still here. That is not why. Yes, that is why. Yeah, I felt sorry for you. Mm -hmm. Anyway, um, yeah, that's how we met, and uh, it's been all downhill from there. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, just kidding. after our third date, I told Devon I just wanted to be friends. I flew to New York. Mm -hmm. um, I was not having a good time in New York. My brother paid for my ticket to come back. I called Delvon and said, hey, will you pick me up at the airport? And of course, Delvon, working his little game, well, I'm playing a gig on the San Juan Islands. I'll pick you up if you go to my gig and stay with Wait me for a the minute. weekend. That wasn't a game. I didn't have time to pick you up because I didn't have time to take you anywhere else. I had to go. So therefore, yes, I can pick you up, but you got to roll with. So, needless or to say, the bus, one or the other. we're not friends. We've been together ever since, 16 years later. Yeah. So, I don't know who won. I did. No, me. I win. 
I wee. But anyway, so that's how we met. That's enough of us. <laughs> what? Go on. Uh, I'm just going to talk to you about all the fun stuff that we've done because I've been gone working behind the scenes, um, taking care of my health. And no, I've been taking over for a year. No, yeah, she. No, well, but no, he has been very helpful. I'm very appreciative of you. I have pulled my share of weight. Okay. It took 16 of, years, but lot, he's there. A lot of weight to pull. There's hope. Mm -hmm. huh. Anyway. Who's weight? Okay. Never talk about I said weight. I've been pulling I'm my saying. weight. I know, I'm joking. I'm See, this is what I deal with on a daily basis. Hmm. She don't listen to nothing. Anyway, uh, so we've had like... A, don't make me start about talking about listening. We've uh, had an amazing like trajectory, you know, over the last, I don't know, eight years? How long we've been together? Eight years or something like that? Uh, but we've gotten to do a lot of things that I would have never foreseen, you know, getting to go on the road with Jack White, uh, Black Crows, uh, both of those, all those guys are awesome, man. And, uh, you know, John Legend, that was cool. We just, oh, I sound like Devon Lewis. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. You're a little yeah. slow. This video is going to be like an hour long. Oh, well, you're the one that wanted us to talk about all this stuff. Recap. Recap about what just happened. Recap where we're going. Didn't I That's just... That's not a recap. That's didn't a I forward cap. No. All that stuff already happened. How can it be forward if it hasn't... If it already we happened? We have to talk about what we've done. What? Are we going backwards Jack White, in time? Jack Crow, John Legend. Did I not just say that? I could have swore I just said... I told... Didn't I just say it? She don't listen to nothing. But now we have proof. Yeah, absolutely have listen? proof. Yeah, we're going to rewind the tape. Rewind it. Tell yeah, us. take that cassette tape out of there and then yeah. rewind it. So. <laughs> anyway, but uh, <laughs> check this out. You guys, can, <laughs> you guys can always find out what we're doing and what we're up to and uh, find out about all the new releases coming out, all that good stuff. If you subscribe to Delvon Lamar Oregon Trio's email list, uh, we promise we won't send you a whole bunch of emails. It's just every now and then. I don't know about that. I can't promise that. But no, just kidding. go to <laughs> DLO3, DLO, the number three music.com. Click the subscription and find out where we're going to be because I'm getting tired of hearing people say, Oh, I didn't even know you were coming. Yeah, you did. It's everywhere. It's everywhere. But our newsletter know, tells you a lot of information. There. And our newsletter will always give you information you may not even know or see. Look. Can you show them your music. titty? What are you doing? Look. Oh my gosh. Okay. This is so. so anyways, I have so many things in store for Devil on the Morgan Trail, as I always do. But um, many more exciting things. So please continue to follow us. And I promise you we will never leave you astray. Um, it's so important to know that one of the biggest things that people don't know about Double on the American Trail is when I took over my husband's career back in 2015, I didn't do it just for him. I know a lot of people think, oh, it's Amy's husband, blah, 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 blah. Yes, I believe in my husband. I believe in his talent. But I also believe in a lot of artists. And I'm out here fighting for artists who have fought so hard to make it in an in industry that is not that easy to make it. And one of the biggest things that does help people, no matter how good your music is, is having the right people behind you to support you. And I can't do it for everyone. I know I've been reached out worldwide to have people to have me sign them and do the same thing. And, and that's not how I work. I'm all about passion and drive. Um, I have to really believe in your story. There's so many other things that are part of this whole um, recipe of what Amy Novo, aka Shortcake, does. But I do have to admit that we did bring on a new client this year, Cry Cabal and Jiva. Dope. So watch out for them. Uh, first client ever that I've ever have signed. Um, but right now, what's important is I just want to let you know that Amy Novo's purpose is to help artists succeed. My purpose is also out there to help venues to listen to the fans 
and make everything come together. And one of the biggest personal purposes for me is to heal people through the world, in the world through music. If we can all come together at one moment in this entire life that we live in of this chaos and craziness, is if we can come together for an hour and a half, 30 minutes, two hours, whatever it might be. Three and, and a half hours. Trail, yeah, three and a half hours. Yeah. If we can all come together We've and just love it. each other and have a good time, then I've accomplished what I want to be able to do for all of you and help artists be successful. So thank you so much for following my journey, Devil on the Morgan Trail's journey, Devil on the Mar journey. Mm -hmm. And we are so excited to announce um, our new drummer, Julian McDonough, who we both have known forever and we love him to death. We're so excited to have him. We've loved every drummer that's ever been with us. We're so excited for these different changes. I know it's so hard for people to understand. You guys go through so many drummers like underwear. Well, there's a lot of things people don't understand on the back end. What it takes for any artist to be, well, number one in a band with Amy Novo, running nah. everything because- Yeah, I quit. I have very chaotic schedules. Um, this is a career. This is not uh, joy. This is not, um, it's not a hobby. It's nothing like it's that. It's not joy. Um, it's joy. Yeah, no, <laughs> you're not gonna enjoy yourself here. Get okay. back to work. So maybe joy was not. Good. No, that's wrong. Right, right word. But that's okay. It's a lot of hard work, it's and it's, that's work. the thing that people don't understand. You guys out there see all the cool stuff on the internet, all the flashy pictures, and us and these, you know, cool places and stuff like that. But people don't know what it takes to get there. It's a lot of hard work. It's a lot of work. A it, lot it, of sleepless cost, days, sleepless nights. It costs a lot of money. Um, First off, I have to pay for everything up front. We tour worldwide, worldwide, all year round. I have to pay for everything up front to make this stuff happen. When we can't play, then we lose money. I can't pay my guys. I can't pay everybody's bills. I can't take care of our own bills. I can't keep us on the road. Um, it's a lot of stress, needless to say, which has led to a lot of my health problems, but that's okay. I love doing what I do, and I'm gonna continue doing what I'm doing for all of you and for Delphon and for any artists that we are working with. Um, but these are important things. Fans buying tickets to come to our shows, fans supporting us. We love all of you, we care about you, and we're gonna continue doing what we do. Our music will always be good no matter who plays with us. So just keep on following our journey and we promise you, you won't be disappointed. But nope. Leading to you guys, on that note, we've lost three tours since December of last year. Big tours. Two of them based off of COVID. Um, I ended up with COVID extremely bad um, on emergency medication, inhaler, had to cancel a tour. Um, Jimmy James, um, our poor guitarist, uh, losing his mother. There's no words or anything that anybody can share about what that could possibly feel like. So I made sure we canceled our Europe tour so he can be there with his mom because not all of us are even able to have those moments to share with somebody before they're no longer with us. And that was tough. It was a massive loss. And then December of last year, if anybody remembers our New Year's Eve tour, we lost because of COVID as well. So I do have a fundraiser and it's named after my song I wrote called Keep On Keeping On. A lot of people don't believe she wrote that. She wrote that tongue, that, that tongue, that tongue, 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 What? Get out, out of my, my head. head. <gasps> Holy crap. Oh, we've been together way too long. 16 years. I'm leaving. No. Yes. Just kidding. You can't get rid of me that easily. Encore. I'm going to be there forever. Lovely. Anyway, yeah. But a lot of people don't believe it, but she wrote that song from start to finish, and it is on our Cold as Weiss album. So keep on keeping on, check it out. It's a good tune. So the same for a fundraiser. We have two fundraisers, um, but I'm only gonna talk about one right now, which is at City Winery in Memphis, Tennessee. Mm, Along no, with that, please. Oh, uh-oh. Look at you and your dead batteries. Shh, just hit close. Always dead so batteries. So we will be playing with. We don't have a lot of time. Yeah, that clearly I your work batteries a lot. dying. You're wasting time. Okay. Right. So Dolly Meredith, which I'm so excited to have her. I was supposed to okay, say. Okay, you that. say it then. You're taking too long. So we're gonna have Dolly Meredith 
she's going to be saying apparently she has a six octave range Yay. i'm really excited to hear disney, that we got her first yeah get out of here disney no uh, you guys can definitely should check Forget. her out We're gonna lose anyway it. It, it ain't gonna die Forget. that fast who else ah uh, caught on klein is going to be there really good friends of ours and potential clients i've been working with them since the pandemic love them all to death they're so awesome yeah, they're a good band man and i got to record on a couple of their tracks and uh yeah i'm looking forward to hearing that so if you live in memphis tennessee or if you don't fly there it's not buy a ticket is it memphis Dude, no you don't know no where it's City not Walmart in is? it's not in memphis it's in nashville Nashville, Tennessee. Don't go to Memphis. Yeah. If you drive to the, to Memphis, then... Uh, Don't listen to Amy Novo because I'm not Good luck with that. Scenes. It's in Nashville, Nashville Tennessee. Tennessee. She don't even know where she's at right now, so don't hold it against her. Do you know her. how many gigs I have in my head? Bless your heart. Do you know how much I work on daily and I gotta put up with them? So, but anyway, but no excuse. I messed up. Nashville, Nashville Tennessee. Nashville, Tennessee. City Nashville. Winery. City Winery. September 6th. September Doors open at seven. Live streamed. Oh, jeez. If you cannot make the live audience, which you want to be part of, because it's going to be on our YouTube at a later date, live stream worldwide to all our fans. For all of you, no one will miss it. But if you can fly there, if you live there, if you know somebody, your grandchildren, your dogs, your parents. Yeah, send all your dogs. All of them. Yeah. Yeah. Have your dogs have some wine. There'd be a bunch of drunk dogs around. That'd be weird. What would that be like? Why would the dog be drinking? The pig? Oh no. Oh no. They'd be telling, they'd be singing the blues. Wow. So anyway. Oh no. We love all of you. Thank you for joining me. And I hope you enjoy this rare opportunity with both of us together. The blues. That is our marriage. Oh my gosh. My woman does love me. We hope to see you there. Please check us out, dealwithyourmusic.com. Email subscription, you'll get all the good details. If you see us online, what helps us to continue to coming out to you, you guys always ask me all the time, buy tickets, share our stuff, like our stuff, tell people about us. That's what helps us to get to you. Yes. But I have lots of exciting stuff for the future, so keep an eye out because Amy will not disappoint, promise.